Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Chill of All Ages Hollywood Shono here, about to give you another Hollywood Shono in real life video. And in this video, I would like to open up a package that I received for a future sponsored video slash giveaway. And what we have here is game vices for iPhones, iPhone 7 Plus. And all together, we have, looks like five of these. Now, one of these is going to be going to Savage Wolf because we are going to be testing out a game called Chrono Blade. But, as you can see right here, I have a total of five game vices. Four of them will be given away and one of them will be given to Savage Wolf for making my video. So, basically, what is Game Vice for those of you guys that are unaware? Game Vice is a piece of tech that gives you Bluetooth support for a controller. So, basically, you just open this up put it on your controller and it also gives you a headphone jack within this controller as well. So if you're running for example an iPhone 7, iPhone 7 Plus or an iPhone 8 which I'm sure it's going to support as well even though the box does not specify it. Well with that said and as I've said I have a total of five of these all together. Four of these will be given away and I'll have more details on that in the upcoming future. And there's an instruction manual for Chrono Blade, which you can see right here. I was given three of these, so I don't know if these are just manuals for people or an instruction manual for the actual games. But just so all my YouTube viewers, subscribers, or fanboys are aware, I will be doing a giveaway for a Game Vice controller for the iPhone only. I have four of these to give away, one of which obviously is for Savage Wolf. To be eligible, you have to follow Facebook at HTTPS colon slash slash www.facebook.com slash chronoblade twitter at twitter.com slash play chronoblade instagram at www.instagram.com slash chronoblade game i will be picking four winners on monday march 12th which is seven days from now winners will be contacted on twitter in a direct message winners are to provide me their address in order for me to ship it if the game looks interesting to you, please click on the link in the top of my description. Go.onelink.me slash an influencer Hollywood Shona. I will have a link to that in the description as well. Now, if you guys are curious about some of the gameplay within Chrono Blade, be sure to check that out. And if you like this little video talking about Chrono Blade as well as the giveaway, please give this video a like rating comment subscribe share this video amongst your friends and as a favorite check out my other hollywood shono videos playlist facebook twitter and twitch which are all hollywood shono my instagram which is hollywood shono god and i will obviously be doing a gameplay video from my galaxy note 8 or from my ipad on chrono blade in the very near future have a wonderful day kids all right, so as you can see in progress, we're doing some Chrono Blade gameplay. As you can see, it's kind of like a side-scrolling beat-em-up with a bunch of RPG elements in it, as Savage Wolf currently has a 47-hit combo and building up. It is ruthless. And on the top of the screen, you can see the health meters of the opponent. And on the left, you can see the health meter of Savage Wolf, who is using the iPhone to test out the game vice controller, which you can see him playing right there as he is using this to make the demonstration video. Now this is obviously a trial version of Air Server. I'm sure that by the time I actually am done with this, it won't be. But there you can see the Drog Crush Huddle. And you can see the health bar going down as his health is going down. He's just viciously beating him. And as you can see on the bottom middle, there's some abilities that you can use with cooldowns. And there's also various other attack. You can do single attack as he just wiped them out. Dual attack and blocking. And you get some rewards. And it looks like he three-starred it. So you can tap to equip. And your party is assembled. You can change your hero at any time before battle and choose a hero. So it looks like you can choose your hero every time that you start a mission. So you have four choices to use all together. And this will obviously be good if you can... If you want to play with certain people in the future, or if you want to just show off a certain character. And if you can beat the stage in a certain amount of time, you get three stars. And obviously be doing another gameplay video 
off my Samsung phone in the very near future. Now, obviously, you don't have to use a Game Vice controller. You can use on-screen features, but for this demonstration, we're using a Game Vice controller. And there's some really sweet combo you can do on this. So, if you like the Streets of Rage type games, you're definitely going to enjoy this. Savage Wolf punching a drag well down. And what's really cool about the Game Vice controller is that it hotkeys a lot of the skills as well. So you don't have to press on the screen. Which is nice if you're not a collector of fingerprints, but want to play without having to touch the screen. Which we do all the time anyways, but now that we have that option to do it, you can play it just like a PlayStation Vita or a Nintendo Switch. It's pretty cool that he's just throwing rocks out of nowhere. So now it looks like he's fighting a big rock golem. Powered Rune Lord with 627 health. Still probably no match for Savage Wolf as he slows him down. Insufficient mana to use that skill. So mana in this game basically lets you use your skills and obviously it will recharge over time which allows you to use set abilities. So you want to obviously use the abilities when you can as you just got one ability. And it looks like the slow is the one that costs more. So he's got a minute and five left to go. The Rune Lord is at 200 health. Savage Wolf boxing around like he's Muhammad Ali. Power Rune Lord only has 32 health left and he's going to go down. And there's the materials. You get 1,000 gold and 10 XP. And he did three-star that because he beat that in less than two minutes. So finishing the tutorial will also give you random rewards as well. And reaching player level six can also give you some rewards. And I will be doing another video talking about more of these materials in detail. And you can see 10,020 crystals. That's a lot. I don't know if that's because of the Hollywood show on a referral link, why you got 10,000 crystals. But you can't go wrong with that. I wouldn't buy it. Not so you know what, what you actually need. I wouldn't just buy stuff. So you can uh, get a gold item chest for free. So you get a crystal item chest and a gold item chest for free. And it looks like every five minutes you can get a free uh, gold item chest as well. So that's pretty cool. And you can also buy gold for uh, crystals as well. I don't think I'd recommend that if you get a thousand per mission. Uh, yeah, you don't want to be naming a new thing. So there's limited dungeons, adventure, and obviously the story mode. And what's really cool is that you can upgrade your gear as well. So not only can you equip gear, but you can also level it up too. So it's got that customization, which is really cool. And I'm very proud to be bringing you this Chrono Blade sponsored video. However, there'll probably be more YouTube videos that are not sponsored which I'll be making off my iPad or my Samsung phone, and I'll get some more details to come. So if you like this little sponsored video showing off some Chrono Blade gameplay as well as what to expect from it, and I'd also like to thank Savage Wolf for testing out these lovely controllers, please give this video a like rating, comment, subscribe, share this video amongst your friends, and as a favorite, check out my other Hollywood Chrono and Real Life Videos playlist, Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch, which are all Hollywood Chrono. And if you want one of these controllers, make sure you get involved with that giveaway. Have a wonderful day, kids. slash Hollywood show now. Subscribe, bitches!